Big Fight, sponsored by 666bet.com. This is James Gold of Bryfeld TV in association with Matt Coons, Jim Marbella and bet666.com. Quite a number I've got Alex Arthur. What's happening, Alex? What's happening, James? All good? <laughs> I'm all right, I'm all right. Uh, with me, I've got Louis Petit. How are we doing, Louis? No, I'm good, really, James. Good. good, that's what I like to hear. Massive card on the bad blood. Great stage for yourself to perform on. Talk to me a little bit about your fight, mate. Um, I've got an Argentinian. I've watched him a couple of, couple of little clips on YouTube. He's decent. He's not the typical foreign. He comes over here, has a go of a couple of rounds and then rolls over. He's, he's in a tough night's work, so it is a step up. But um, one I've trained for and I can't wait, really. I want it to be a good, hard fight. So it shows on this bill. I don't want to be the easy one that everyone forgets about. Jim made Bradley Skeets in a very tough fight against Frankie Gavin. Um, looking at the route Bradley's come, it's quite similar to yourself, isn't it? Fighting on maybe the undercard of the big shows, working your way up to, to chief support and, and so forth, so forth. Is that the kind of way you're looking to go? Yeah, definitely. I mean, it gets you good exposure and obviously fighting in front of, hopefully there's a good few thousand in there by the time I box. I think I'm the first live fight at six, so it won't be packed, but it should be a good, good couple of thousand in there, so it's a good atmosphere. And I mean, watching, watching what Brad's done, I'm really confident for him as well. Yeah, how many tickets have you done? How, how much can we, uh, uh, team can we expect down there? Between so both of us, we've done like about 1,500 because obviously a lot of us know the same people we're from the same area, so of it's course. a bit, bit tougher having two from the same gym fighting, but we're well over like the 100k mark mm. on tickets up, so we're frank to our feet, you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> Talking a little bit about the main event, Derek Chisora versus Tyson Fury too. How do you see that one playing out, Lou? Um, I keep changing my mind this one. In July, I was dead cert. Fury's going to win, box his head off and just hit a move and he's too good for him. But now it's come around again in November, I keep changing my mind. I don't, I don't know why. I've seen Derek, he looks in good shape, he looks calm. I, don't, I think before I thought he was just going to run forward and he weren't really that interested. He didn't seem interested, but this time he seems like he might have trained him, but Tyson looks in good shape today. All right, uh, quick prediction for Billy Joe Saunders versus Chris Eubank Jr. Uh, Saunders wins on points. Saunders points. Yeah. Going to have a little fluff? Uh, yeah, definitely. I think. Uh, I think Brad Fury, Saunders, and Liam Walsh, good odds to do that as an accumulator. Fair play. Make sure you do it via bet666.com. Will do. Appreciate it, Luke. Cheers, Best James. of luck, mate. See you at the way tomorrow. Thanks. Thank you, mate. Bye. The Big Fight, sponsored by 666bet.com.